Rose Steel here from Fashion Steel NYC and welcome back to my channel. Do not forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you love fashion, beauty, lifestyle, and travel videos. So I have a really fun vlog for you today. I'm taking you guys on another day with me here in Harlem. We're going to start off with a nasty gal haul. You guys have been loving these nasty gal hauls. I got a few things, a couple of tops, some really cool loungewear, some great summer dresses and sandals. So we will kick it off with that. And also special thanks to Nasty Gal for sponsoring today's video. Yes, links to everything will be down below in the description box. Also taking you guys through my workout routine. I've been getting a lot of questions about my workout routine. So just gonna show you a few things that we do. Also going to take you guys behind the scenes of shooting content at home for collaborations with my girl and photographer Rose at Dad Do Chic. And then we're gonna hang out in Harlem. We're gonna go out, we're gonna get some food. It's gonna be a very fun, Day. let's just get right into the nasty gal haul Ooh, child but first coffee because you guys it is like 7 45 in the morning anywho let's start with my outfit of the day because of course it's nasty gal So first up, I'm wearing this really cool top from Nasty Gal. What I love about it is this part actually comes apart and you can tie it in different ways. It has a little stretchy part here in the back. I got the size six and I absolutely love it. It's the perfect neutral. You can pair it with just about anything. High-waisted retro skirts, baggy jeans or mom jeans and a pair of really cool sandals. This actually comes in a few different colors. I got the size six. So it has these two bands across and then you just tie this. That's how it is. And then you just tie it any way you like. So I will link it down below for you guys and you can check it out. And also wearing a really pair of cool denim jeans. You guys know that I love jeans that are really unique. These are very Margiela-esque. They have those cool cutouts on the sides, like right by your thighs. And otherwise they're just a baggy, very kind of laid back jean. They are high waisted and very small around the smallest part of your hips and then flare out. So really form fitting. They're really flattering for your figure and you can wear them with like heels or dress them down with a pair of sandals or sneakers. So currently I have mine rolled up at the hem there at the bottom because they are fairly long. They will work well with like a pair of very tall heels and my favorite Bottega Veneta mules. So that is my outfit of the day. If you're interested in shopping this look, of course you can find all of the links down below in the description box. And I must mention that if you happen to purchase anything from any of the links down below, I do receive a small commission from the brand and that helps your girl out a lot as a full-time content creator so that I can keep making these videos for you guys. And I also will have a coupon code for you guys to use. I will also include it down below in the description box for you all. Anywho, let's get into the rest of what I got from Nasty Gal. All right guys, so first up I got two midi dresses. You know how I feel about a midi dress or a maxi dress for summer. And when I saw these on the Nasty Girl website, I thought yes, yes, and yes. So first up is this white midi dress. You guys, it is everything. It has this little knot here in the front. Very similar to my very colorful like maxi dress. It has those little stretchy poof sleeves, kind of a v-neck and it's super long and it buttons all the way down the front here. It's a very kind of thick, very solid material. I feel like this is very well made, like it's really going to last. I love it. I got the size six, US size six and it fits perfectly. I love where it hits me. It's super dainty, very feminine dress. I think it would be perfect for like a visit to the beach or a day in Central Park. Just beautiful. I loved it so much. I also got it in this like very mauvey pink lavender-ish color. Same thing has that little like knot here by the bust. 
those stretchy poofy sleeves has a little dart right here like right under your bust and then buttons all the way down the front and I love that the buttons are the same color as the dress very kind of heavy but still light material and just stunning I love both of these dresses of course I do because I got the same dress in two colors I actually think they have a few colors in this dress so if you're interested check out the links below I definitely feel like this is one of their dresses that are going to sell out really quick don't forget to use my coupon code and there is a zip here on the side in case you are interested the buttons do unbutton as well so you can button up or down as much as you want to your liking if you feel like you want to be a little more daring leave a few buttons unbutton and then you can have a nice slit so that is the first two things i got from nasty gal these beautiful midi dresses cool y'all it is blazing hot i'm so sorry but i'm sweating next up of course i got some loungewear because nasty gal has the best stuff when it comes to loungewear i will link a few of my favorite pieces down below in the description box as well for loungewear as well as for midi dresses in addition to the ones i'm showing you today in this video you guys know i live for a biker short some of you guys are with it and some of you aren't but i feel like a biker short is great because it feels comfortable it feels just like loungewear you can wear it in your house you can wear it while working out you can throw on a blazer and a padded muscle shirt and a pair of bottega heels and you got an outfit and at nasty gal they have the best biker shorts so i got this set just plain black biker shorts but the thing about these is I like the length I don't like the very short biker shorts that like sit right under your butt curve I like the longer ones that might hit you like mid thigh or just above the knee and these are very well made like some of the biker shorts I've seen on other sites they're very thin you can see through them not with these they are thick they are really stretchy and substantial material very very well made and so this set comes with the biker shorts and a little bandu top that matches it like how cute is that and then it has like kind of a little ruffled top and it is double fabric so this is not see-through also stretchy very substantial material and so this is a set you guys and it's so affordable just click the link below and check it out so this set i got it in black can you see this? I will style this for you guys, probably with a little blazer and my Bottega mules. It's a lurk. I got it in black. I got it in brown, kind of like a toffee brown. I love this color, by the way, with the matching bandeau. Oh, too good, too good, you guys. And I also got it in gray. I had to, the price was too good. And the material, oh, this gray one is perfect with the matching bandeau now i can do so much with these pieces you can wear them together you can wear them separately you could just wear this with like a white tee you can wear this with like a pair of jeans like the ones I'm, i have on now and it's a look invest in things that you can wear multiple ways in your wardrobe that are affordable and that are not going to shrink on the first wash like these are so thick yet very well made very good so i got the size small medium and it fits perfectly if you're interested i will link all three colors down below just stop the video if you're interested in these go ahead and get them because i have a feeling once people see that they come in a set now and that they're so affordable they're gonna sell out you heard it here first kids so those are my three uh biker shorts and bandu top loungewear sets from nasty gal and finally i got a pair of sandals so i needed some very like neutral tone flat sandals i have some brown i have some black but i needed a neutral tone so i got these cuties from nasty gal super 
affordable. I love that they have padding at the bottom and that they have a toe ring. I don't have many sandals that have a toe ring. In fact, I think I only have one other pair, but I really love that detail. I think that it's trendy, it's super cute, and these are very comfortable. I got the size 41. I'm usually a US size 10, and in a Euro shoe, I'm a 41, and these fit perfectly. Nasty Gal has a really great array of summer sandals. And so if you're in the market for some sandals and you're looking for really trendy sandals that are comfortable and affordable, definitely check out Nasty Gal. I will link these down below along with a few of my other favorites from the website. There you have it kids. That is our very small, quick and efficient Nasty Gal haul. Special thanks to Nasty Gal for sponsoring today's video. Do not forget to check them out. There's a link to everything down below and you can use my coupon code for a discount. So now that I've shown you what I have gotten from Nasty Gal, I am going to take off this makeup. I'm gonna show you guys a few of my new end skincare products as well from Elemis. I'm gonna take off this makeup even though I feel like I look so cute today. I don't wanna take it off. I'm gonna take off this makeup and then I'm gonna get ready for my workout today. You guys know every weekend at 10 o'clock, every Saturday and Sunday, like clockwork, I do a Zoom workout with my girl Gloria, Life with Glory B on Instagram. A lot of you have been asking me about my workout routine. If you're new here, leave a little hands up emoji down below. I do often show my workouts in my vlog, so just head on down to the vlog section down below, check those out. You can see a few things that we do. I don't like to show you the entire workout because she is a black owned business. And if you wanna join our workout classes, just DM her on Instagram and she will give you the details. I think it's $10 for every class on Saturday and Sunday. And then if you would like to work out with her during the week, she works out almost every day at 7.30 during the week, 7.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, and those classes are free. So it's a win-win. You can get your summer body ready for 2021. 2021, you heard it here first. Let's go ahead and get ready for the rest of the day. I'm gonna do my workout. Rose is gonna come over. We're gonna shoot a few brand campaigns, show you guys how that works, and then we're gonna head out to Harlem and uh, find some food. It's gonna be a fun day. Stick around, kids. Whew, you guys, it is a boiling in my apartment today. So if I'm a little sweaty, I'm so sorry. Like, it's literally 9.15 and it's already maybe 85 degrees. Oh, uh, anywho, today is Sunday. Every Sunday, I have a new YouTube video that goes live. And today's video is the Black Designers Fashion and accessories collection try on haul. And so before I take off my makeup, I'm gonna go ahead and do my Insta stories that are going to go live when that video goes live today, probably around one or noon. Then I'm gonna take this makeup off, then I'm gonna do my workout at 10. So I got a good 45 minutes before my workout starts. So I put on one of the designers featured in the video, which is Fee Noel, a really great black owned kind of luxury designer fashion brand. Definitely check it out, it's amazing. And uh, if you want details on this, I will link it down below as well, or you could just head over and check out Fina Wells' website. So let's go ahead and do my Insta stories and then I'll take you guys through my makeup removal skincare routine. Good afternoon, Insta Stories, and happy Sunday. It is Sunday, so there is a new video up on my YouTube channel. I'm finally doing my black fashion designer um, clothing and accessory collection. So this video is definitely a long time coming. I wanted to do my part in um, shining light on just some amazing brands that everyone should know about. And so it features some of my favorite gonna have to do that again all right guys um also just in case you all missed anything over on the blog this past 
week a lot went on so i'm gonna do a little recap and if you missed anything you can swipe up and check it out all right guys so just in case you missed it on wednesday i posted a new in shopping haul video where i show you a ton of new things i bought for summer as well as a ton of things in from pr and brands the video is called shopping is my cardio and so if you missed it definitely swipe up to check that video out and then over on the blog fashion still nyc on friday i wrote about my entire work from home routine and schedule how i schedule my days as a full-time content creator in walmart fashion so showing you guys a few of my favorite things from walmart from summer dresses to loungewear you guys they have the best loungewear to like house dresses because you know i live for a house dress so if you want to see how i break my days up um swipe up here and check out this blog post ah <sighs> doing a little dancing this morning on my insta stories if you guys watch me on insta stories you know every now and then i dance while i make my espresso coffee or after i've made it it's just a little fun thing i like to do because i love afro beats and soca music so i usually play that music while i dance and people look forward to it so if i'm up to it i do it so today you'll see a little behind the scenes of me setting up for that, regular tripod from Amazon, regular phone clip from Amazon. Put my phone on there. Set up my Insta stories. Oh, I know what song I wanna to dance to. I haven't danced to this one in a while. It's one of my favorites. I also have a, a Soka and Afrobeats playlist over on SoundCloud. I'll link it down below. Also, if you head over to my Instagram, click the link in my bio and scroll down to Butt First Coffee playlist. My whole playlist is there as well. By the way, you should be following me on Instagram at Monroe Steel. All the tea is over there for sure. Now I am a hot sweaty mess after dancing, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this makeup off now that my Insta stories are already done for the day and get ready for today's workout. Whew, I am hot. All right guys, so you all know that I speak about Elemis all the time. They have some of my favorite skincare products and lately i've been double cleansing because i have been having a few breakouts around where i wear my mask or mask me i know a lot of you are having the same issue and so what's been help helping me is to make sure i'm double cleansing this also works if you have a lot of makeup being pushed into your hairline and you're getting breakouts around your hairline double cleansing can help with that as well and basically that just means cleansing twice usually with two different products and so to start i'm going to use the new element superfood aha glow cleansing butter and this is made with pumpkin which is of course a superfood i like that they use naturally occurring products this is what it looks like there's barely any smell which is great because i'm not down with a lot of fragrances for my skin to take off my lip because it is a matte lip stain this is still an area by the way i wear this all the time i will link it down below i use the elements white flower eye and lip makeup remover now the great thing about this is it's kind of an oil base you can see you have to kind of shake it up before you use it and I'll just take one of my Chanel cotton wipes. I'll link all of this stuff down below, including the cotton wipes. I'll just put a little bit here on this pad. And it's kind of an oily consistency. So you can see this is super matte and stuck on my lip. Like, I can't just wipe it off. That's a one go. Like, this stuff is amazing. The good thing is it has no taste. It has no smell and it's delicate enough to use to remove eye makeup as well so i'll show you that too this is like one of my favorite beauty products and i do have a coupon code for you guys if you want to check out any elements products you can use my coupon code monroe 20 all capital letters for 20 percent off until september 2020. so look how good that removed all of my eye makeup as well 
and it's great even if you get in it in your eye it doesn't like hurt your eye at all so I'm gonna wipe off my brows too I've been trying to do a little something with my brows but my brows just want to be crazy like they really don't care they want to do their own thing so so I let them I will link the white flowers eye and lip makeup remover down below because it is literally the best makeup remover out the best makeup remover I have ever tried in my life and it's good you want to make sure you're really getting your makeup off that is it so now I'm gonna go in with my cleanser by the way I love that this has no fragrance because I don't like a lot of fragrance and I find that it, it can break me out too and y'all know I have the most sensitive skin on the planet You see how that dissolves that makeup? All right, let's wash this off. All right, so that was the first cleanse. Now we're gonna go in and do the second cleanse. I'm gonna again use an Elemis product, which is the Gentle Foaming Facial Wash. This is one of my favorite products. I absolutely love it. It smells amazing. It leaves your face nice and moisturized. And then it gets off any of your residual makeup. I do have very deep pores on my cheeks and I feel like this is one of the best products to get anything left in those deep pores out. And I also make sure I go up into my hairline as well and around my ears and also my neck. Don't forget your neck with your skincare routine. It shows aging before your face does. And then I like to take the extra and do my hands. With all of this hand washing, you guys, our hands are gonna age so fast. So if it's good enough for your face, it's definitely good enough for your hands too. All right, let's wash this off. All done with the second cleansing. And now to dry my face. Really the only thing that touches my face are these cotton <laughs> wipes. I don't use a towel, I don't use really anything, a washcloth, nothing but these cotton pads. Then I also like to see if I still have any makeup on. Okay, pretty clean. Now, I'm gonna go in with a little Pixie Vitamin C Tonic. This helps with hyperpigmentation, dark spots, which I do have. They've gotten a lot better though, so I'm happy about that. This also gets off any residual makeup. I also go behind my ears. I let that dry and then I'm going to put on some moisturizer. For the moisturizer, I'm going to use some of my Rael Beauty. I think I did an unboxing showing you guys this in a previous vlog. Daily Restoration Nourishing Gel Cream and I'm going to be working out. I'm going to sweat so I just wanted something light that's going to protect me from the sun and nourish my skin while I'm working out. I usually work out in my living room, so that place gets a lot of sun. Now I wanna protect my skin and I also make sure my dark spots aren't getting darker from the sun. All right guys, so that is my skincare routine. Again, if you wanna check out any of the Elements products, I do have a coupon code MONROE20, all capital letters, for 20% off until September. Check them out. Some of my favorites include the AHA Elements Superfood Cleanser, the Gentle Foaming Face Wash. I also love the Peptide Pore Nighttime Recovery Cream Oil. guys my workout with Gloria is complete started at 10 we just finished up at 11 I'm going to hop in the shower now Rose is coming over at noon so I have one hour to get ready I have two campaigns to shoot I think they will both be live by the time this video goes live so I'll be able to show you behind the scenes of shooting some content 
both pieces of content kind of need to be shot in the home they're both lifestyle products that i use and love and so i'll show you the behind the scenes of how we shoot content in my apartment and then i'll show you the finished products that are probably already posted on instagram with the last video i did with the come spend the day with me in brooklyn a lot of you guys really love the behind the scenes and, and asked me to shoot more behind the scenes content and how you can create content in your home it's very easy it's probably the easiest kind of content you can create so i will show you guys a bit of that but i am super tired gonna clean up shower and get ready for rose to come over So while I was working out, I heard a sound like something fell and I kind of came and looked around to see what it was but couldn't find anything. But I found it y'all. This is a true fashion girl problem. <laughs> oh my god, look. It broke. The whole thing came down you guys. So this is pretty much my coat closet because as you can see I have all my winter coats. For now we're just going to pretend like this doesn't exist. <laughs> if this has ever happened to you leave a hands up emoji down below in the comments. Don't know what I'm going to do about that but we'll see. So I need to do a little ironing. I'll be wearing this cute little dress for one of the campaigns. Alright guys, just did a little ironing. I'm actually probably going to wear this little set here for the first campaign because it's for a shaving product called Billy. If you've never heard of it, definitely check it out. They have these really amazing razors. They have a magnetic clip so that you could put it up in your shower. They have really great shaving lotion or shaving mousse and also body lotion. It smells so good, you guys. That will be the first thing Rose and I shoot today. And then we are also shooting a little something for secret deodorant. So, should be fun. I'll show you guys a little behind the scenes of that. I'm probably gonna eat something really quickly and then do a very light face since these photos are meant to be, you know, home, very homey. And then I think Rose and I might go get something to eat. I'll probably throw on one of my nasty gal fits from earlier and then there's this restaurant that I love in Harlem maybe we'll go there and then I want some cookies too we'll definitely take you guys with us wherever we go for lunch because it's it's a definite that we're gonna brunch today I mean it's the weekend why not so yesterday I made some guacamole it's really delicious I just put some in a very little container. I have some chips here. Probably just gonna eat a little bit of that because I wanna preserve my appetite for a delicious meal. Alexa, turn on 
family room TV. Okay. All right, love, so I did a very quick, just natural look, a little brow. This very kind of nudey lip is called NARS Dance Fever Lip Pencil, and I will put it down below. It works really well if you have like kind of a yellow undertone like I do. The foundation is NARS Sheer Glow foundation just waiting for rose she's on her way she should be here soon i actually already just did some quick stories for billy this actually has to go live today y'all that's how the cookie crumbles like sometimes a brand will send you something and it gets lost in the mail or you get it late and it's like oh yeah uh can you have it up tomorrow <laughs> and i'm just like sure so gotta keep the clients happy I actually really do love the Billy products you guys the shave cream is just amazing like the razor it has five blades usually I'm not really into razors that have tons of blades but this one is actually really really good because it's aerodynamically made for women's use you know we're delicate we have a lot of nooks and crannies and it, it's outlined in charcoal shave soap so it makes it super easy every time i've used it i haven't gotten any cuts or anything it's like the perfect razor if you're interested in this definitely check it out i'll link it down below i just also love what they stand for too definitely check out their instagram so you can kind of get a sense of what i'm talking about but their shave cream is bomb no parabens sulfates no synthetic fragrances soothing shea butter sage you guys aloe vera it smells so good like the sage in it it's just so refreshing and then they also have a body lotion which is the same it has grapeseed oil aloe vera oil and shea butter and your legs will be shining shining and highly moisturized afterwards so if you have super dry skin definitely try billy shave products they're so good we're gonna shoot that first i have an idea of what i want to do i think i want to lie on the bed with my legs up and laugh and then we're gonna shoot secret and i'm gonna do that in my bedroom as well concepts i always just think of like natural concepts nothing too over the top when i'm kind of planning my content i just want this photo to be super relatable i'm gonna be in my little set here you know, something people will wear around the house, maybe if they're alone or when they're applying their serums and lotions, you know, you might have on a little something like this. And then I'm just gonna lay on my bed and have fun. Hopefully it connects, I think people will like it. And we'll see how it goes. When Rose gets here, I'll show you guys the best behind the scenes of the shoot. So I tidied up a bit because this is where we're going to shoot the first photo here. And we'll see how it goes. Look how gorgeous this woman looks. Bonjour. Making herself a Nespresso. Don't mind my dirty dishes. It's been a long week. What do you think about like this? You know, showing off my legs. You want the full body? Can you, can you just get my legs? down time to do secret this is what we do we just think of some concepts yeah i usually execute i usually have a concept and then she tries to execute it and if it's whack then she she basically tells me what to do <laughs> so get you a friend and photographer no who, we work really well together who knows <laughs> angles and concepts and how things look in a photo and you're really good at directing and coming up with your concept so it's easy. i'm good with a concept yeah. i'm not so good at actually you make it easy she does the rest she literally the first time we shot together she told me how to pose <laughs> she was like oh i need you to come stand just 
like this with your face soft pink hair. And I was like, oh, <laughs> would you like for me to take your photo? Because I feel like you know what you're doing. You're silly. <laughs> All right, we're going to shoot secret. I'm going to change into a little silk dress, the one I was ironing earlier. And we're going to be done, like literally less than 10 minutes, knocked out two campaigns. In look number two, little silky number from Urban Outfitters. So hot. Uh, Mad Madame. Yeah. <laughs> How do you put on deodorant, deodorant gracefully, guys? Mm -hmm. Comment down below. <laughs> do you want to maybe sit on the bed? I'm trying to put it on. So the stuff in the back is a little blurry. Yeah. Do people put deodorant on in bed? I think so. All right, now Rose is getting some product shots because she is the champion. Oh, sorry. And we are done. Took about 10, 10 minutes. minutes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> we don't play. So now I'm gonna change into one of my nasty gal looks from earlier. And I think we're gonna go get something to eat. Check back in when we're on our way. All right guys, so I'm all changed. I got a little outfit on. I showed you guys this set earlier from Nasty Gal. It is the brown two-piece biker short and bandeau top set through my and other stories linen pink blazer over top. This is the oversized blazer. Added my Gia Pernil brown sandals. Got these from Farfetch. They come in a few different colors. My favorite little shell ankle bracelet. The earrings are Ana Luisa and the bag is Cray. You guys remember I worked with Cray BK a few times. This is one of my favorite little crossbody bags. So just keeping it neutral with a pop of blush pink. I'm gonna call a car and we're gonna head down for a quick brunch in Harlem. Harlem and now we're heading to Les Amizad. I hope I'm saying that correctly. I will put it down below in the description box. If you're in Harlem, you can check it out. And they have outdoor seating, which is great. lamb chops there, some couscous. Look at this. That looks good. All right guys, so the verdict is, it's delicious. Oh my God, beyond, beyond. So freaking good. Like, I'm gonna have to take this home, <laughs> but it's cooked to perfection. And what I realized is you can only eat African food when um, you don't got nothing else to do for the rest of the day. Especially on a hot day like today. <laughs> it's just not a good mix. Because now I need a nap. Yeah. I got the itis. Yum. 
That's a lot of lamb. It is. It's a good portion. I'm gonna take it home. Eat it later tonight. All right, guys, so I am back home relaxing it is so hot outside it was a really good day today i hope you all enjoyed spending the weekend with me if you did enjoy this video please do give your girl a thumbs up do not forget to subscribe and click that little notification bell so that you never miss a video and again special thanks to nasty gal for sponsoring today's video everything that i showed in the haul can be found down below in the description box you can also use my code for a little discount all right guys i will see you in the next video and thank you so much for watching bye guys